so let's just see how we can install windows 10 ltsc version so first of all you have to download the iso file of the ltsc from the official microsoft website so in the previous video i have shown you how we can download the official iso file so after you have downloaded the file we have to create one bootable drive so we're gonna open rufus and here we're gonna select the iso file now here the partition scheme will be gpt and keep everything as it is and then click on start now here it is giving the warning that all the data on the device will be destroyed so so click on ok to continue with the process and this will take some time to create the bootable drive and after it is completed then we're gonna restart the computer and we're gonna boot into that bootable drive here we have to select the language the currency and the keyboard we're gonna keep the same and click on next now here we're just gonna click on install now now from here we have to select the operating system so here we have two options so we're gonna select the windows 10 ltsc evaluation and then click on next now here we have to accept the license agreement and then click on next now here we're gonna select the custom install so that we can select the preferred drive where we wanted to install our windows now here you can see we have drive 0 and drive 1 we wanted to install that in the drive 1 but you can see it is showing this warning so it says windows cannot be installed to this disk the selected disk has a MBR partition table so because it has MBR partition so we have to clean that and we're gonna make it GPT disk so for this we have to use the shortcut shift F10 and this will open command prompt now from here we have to use some commands so first of all we're gonna use the command disk part and this will open the disk part console from here we can run different commands to clean the particular disk command list disk so it will list all the available disk in our system so we have three disk now we're gonna select that particular disk with the command select disk one and then we have to use the command clean and it will clean that particular disk and after that we're gonna use the command exit to exit out of the command prompt so once that is done now we can select that particular disk and then we can create partition and we can click on next to continue the installation into that particular disk now we have the installation window so here all the files are copied so it will took some time so let's just fast forward this so once the installation is completed then it will restart to complete the installation of the windows and then after that we can create our account we can set up all the settings so you can see this is the windows 10 ldsc version now here you can see we do not have much so here we have minimum features and also there are not much pre-installed applications so which make this pretty lightweight and it can be run on low-end pcs so there will not be any kind of bloatware in our computer so which makes our computer lot more faster so hope this video is helpful to you see you in the next one take care